friends, I'm showing you some lights here real quick. We're going to show you the Speed Tech Z3s. We have them mounted on our mirrors, on our push bumper, and in the rear window. Put the ones I'm going to show you in the rear. So we'll go ahead and flip on rear strobe, like this. And right now, when they first come on, I have them come on as a straight, steady burn. As you can see right there. So we'll go ahead now, I'm going to switch it over to a flash mode. As you can see, that's quite bright. And one more time, change the color. There you go, it's flashing white amber. The white pops like big time, so you can not miss it when it comes on. And the amber is pretty bright by itself too, but the white's what makes the light so bright. Cool, so we can flip the momentary switch to different modes. And if we hold the momentary switch, it will sync the lights together so that they flash in sync. In sync. And I could do the same thing with the front Z3s, which I'll show you in, at a different time. And we'll show you the mounts that they're on. One second, let me and turn these things off. The particular brackets that I am using with the car, I got on eBay. They're adjustable. They will allow you to pretty much adjust them wherever you want. And there the light is right there. And I'll show you the brick. They're amazing. Kind of hard to get out of there when there's no seat in the back. All right. Walk on over here. These are the brackets that are in the back of the car right now. I'm using a 3M tape to attach them to the window. So I do not want to screw into the anywhere back there just in case, you know, we don't need any surprises later on. So this 3M tape really, really works well. You can get a big roll of it on Amazon or eBay and this stuff is gnarly good. Extremely strong, it's shocking how strong this stuff is. But uh, that's the bracket I'm using for the other lights I'm getting, which are not Z3s. I'm actually, I got a couple of ultra bright lights I'm gonna put back there that are extremely bright and they're no longer made, which has come up where I liked them a lot. So I'm gonna go over here and show you some more Z3s while I'm at it. There's my amber side light. And these two in the front are white amber. So I can switch them between different colors. If I wanna go straight amber, I just hold the button for a second and it will change the power setting and go straight amber. Same with most of my other lights. Though these corner lights are just amber. But these, these lights are incredibly bright, even in the daytime. I'm, I was pretty shocked the first time I turned them on. It's like, whoa, spotlight. <laughs> yeah, they're worth the getting them. I bought these on uh, Amazon Prime for about $16 a pop. So yeah, it, it is isn't a very well-made light, but it's very durable too. And I'll show you the actual light real quick. Got my parts all over the place here. These lights are going to be going on the can behind me on the custom bar. These are multicolored, you see amber red. That's going to be to the rear. And that's for being used in the desert when we're riding. So people don't ruin, ruin us and we're going to be probably making some for other people to get a copy of. And yeah, go over that again with some more paint. But uh, yeah, those lights are awesome. Okay, I'll turn on the uh, Z3 front lights here real quick for you. And just cut it in here. <clears throat> Since the front lights are all tied together, we have our Raptor bar running as well at the same time. Pretty cool. All right, everyone have a great evening. I gotta get some sleep.
Had a long day. Yep, C3 from Speed Tech are awesome.